Hello. Today I want us to talk about one of the common questions that patients ask. They'll call or they'll send us an email or they'll come in for a visit and say, my legs are tired and aching at the end of the day. Uh, maybe I have cramps at night, uh, burning stingy. And I'm wondering if I have vein disease because when I look at my legs, I don't see anything. So uh, today we're going to answer that question for you. The short answer to that question is yes. It is possible to have what we call invisible or hidden vein disease. And the patients can have symptoms uh, that are classic for vein disease. That's heavy legs, achy legs, cramps at night, swelling, even some skin changes or blood clots can have uh, those kind of problems and yet before that never have seen anything visible on the outside of their leg. So that's a really great question. We're going to spend a, about a minute or so talking about some of the background behind that yes answer. First, uh, most patients who have vein disease do notice something. They notice may have spider veins or bulgy veins, or maybe you know they know their family members have had trouble, and so they're they're aware that that's a possible risk factor. Or maybe they work in an occupation where they sit or stand a lot. Maybe they've had children. So there are a lot of factors that can go into increasing your risk. And if you fall in one of those categories and you have symptoms then the chances are a little higher that you might have hidden vein disease. When we see, uh, have those questions asked of us, we think it's very important to get a thorough evaluation. At Vein Specialists of the South, we have multiple options of ways you can do that, uh, including uh, virtualvein.com, which is an online consultation that can help us, uh, help you decide whether you need to come in for an in-person visit. We also have uh, uh, educational sessions where we bring folks in and we'll uh, do education and do a, a survey of their legs. And then patient, some patients decide they want to come in for a full consultation. Either way, we want to get a good history from you. We want to uh, examine your legs. And depending on what we see, we'd probably recommend an ultrasound of your legs. Because with hidden vein disease or invisible vein disease, the only way you can really tell is that ultrasound. But we'd want to make sure you had significant symptoms that would make the ultrasound medical indicated. Based on the ultrasound, your history, and your physical exam, we can tell you. I mean, that's the good news. In the, in the simple office is that we can tell you if there's any underlying vein problems. You might say, well, what, what do you do then? Well, we always start with conservative measures. You may be familiar with us talking about Better Veins for Life principles. And those are four or five things that we recommend, like regular exercise, healthy weight management, wearing some compression socks, which are medical grade, designed specifically for people with vein disease, elevating your legs when you're sitting in the evening to read or watch TV, or just chat with your friends. And uh, for our female patients, we recommend avoiding high heels except for special occasions. So those are conservative measures, but a lot of people want to know, well, what could be done? Is there something that could be done to correct that? And should you have something done if there's invisible or hidden vein disease, when there's no outward uh, visible signs that people might notice? And I think I, let's answer that question. Uh, there is a benefit of treating vein disease if you're symptomatic, whether or not you have visible changes externally, because it is progressive disease. And if you don't do anything about it, it will it'll gradually get worse. And if you treat the underlying problem, maybe you can prevent the damaged veins, the big bulgy veins and varicoses that, that you would never have to have those treated. So there's advantage to early diagnosis, early treatment. There are great options for care. And it's good to know if you're someone suffering from a leg pain that you really don't know why, if it's from vein disease, we can treat it at Vein Specialists of the South. That's what we specialize in. That's what we do day in and day out. Our treatments are all office space walk in, walk out, little and no downtime, a general local anesthetic. If you're anxious, sometimes we'll give you a mild oral sedative, but we'll make you comfortable to have a treatment that can change the quality of your life. Let us know how we can help you, especially if you have visible changes or if you're one of those patients who has symptoms that wonders if you might have underlying vein disease. If you have other questions, you found this helpful and there may be other things you want to know about vein disease, please visit www.veinspecialist.com and go to our blog section. We have a lot of great articles that we've written over the years, and there's just a ton of information that you can learn about vein disease. We'd like to help be the folks that educate you.